guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys had a wonderful day. I know I did. I was off today. But guys, thanks for coming. If you don't know who I am, now you do. It's Justin, guys. Smack that subscribe button below. Become part of the huge family, guys. Before I knock this table over. <laughs> As you can see here, we got another brand new drink today. And I've never even had this before. It is called Terrapin Beer Company from Athens, Georgia. Um, it's Lua. Lua? Luwu, Luwu, Luwa, I don't know. L U A U P O G I P A. Passion fruit and orange uh, guava. Passion fruit, orange guava. Um, where in the world is Crunkles? Is on there also. Brew, beer with natural flavors added. Uh, Pinkerton. What else is on here? Terrapin Beer Company in Newton Bridge Road in Athens, Georgia. It is 6.5% alcohol. There's a little turtle. All right, let's see what it tastes like. I'm excited. Um, I, there's not much to say about this one because I've never had it, so I can't say yay, nay, don't buy, hey, bye. Um, actually, I don't even remember how much it was. I think it was only like $2, so it's not that expensive to get. Um, it was at our local store. So, no. let's see how it is. Ooh, that smells really good. That orange is really like pressing on there. Almost like an orange juice. That passion fruit is what really is going to get me. Because I'm not a huge fan of passion fruit. But guava and orange is heaven. But chit And the can. Look at the can. The can is so beautiful. It's so amazing. Cheers. That's nice. That's nice. The, the softness of this drink is what's really good, honestly. <laughs> the way that they combined all the different flavors, and you get a little bit of everything. Like, as you're drinking it, and you're getting a little bit of that passion fruit. And as you're, like, finishing it, like everything else, like as you're getting ready to swallow it, you get that orange. And then the aftertaste is kind of like a guava in there. It's really nice how they transition the alcohol in the flavors together allowing you to actually get all of those flavors that they say that it's in there not a lot of the times where they're like yeah it has this and it has some of this and it has some of that yes it's great that it has all that stuff but do you really taste it all the time this here i got all three flavors right off the bat <clears throat> within the process of drinking it off the first taste and with it being an ipa it's not really as heavy as a lot of your other ones are when it comes to ipas um, it's really soft, it's really smooth, and it doesn't really bite you back. It has a nice uh, tanginess to it that is really good too. It has a uh, almost like an earthiness tangy to it. Almost like an orange peel. Not necessarily an actual like orange slice. Like an orange peel is what I'm getting more of instead of like an actual orange. Um, so... I think this is a go. This is a good beer. Tastes great. Has a wonderful flavor. And for the price, it's only like $2, $2.5. So it's not like it's breaking the bank to try it. Um, so yeah, go ahead and get you some. Especially if you're down in the Georgia area. Um, not try this. And if you are down in the Georgia area, uh, let me know if you have tried this and if you like it or not. Um, I'm not sure how well-renowned this thing is to be out and about, but that is the drink. Um, again, Terrapin. I have, like I said, never had it, but awesome drink. Tastes amazing. Cheers. It's good. I like it. Tangy. It's like I said, it's like just biting into an orange peel almost is what you're getting from it. But it's great. I like it. So, till then, till later, I'm sorry that I messed up today, again. Uh, today, we were supposed to do the cold 45 and 45 seconds, um, but I went to two different stores today, of which neither had the cold 45s. So, I'm on the hunt for cold 45s, because apparently they don't exist anymore. Uh, so, I ended up buying this at the last store that we was at. Um, so, hopefully, I'll be able to find one tomorrow. I'm off as well, so uh, Pretty Lady will be at work. I gotta go to town and get some things. So I'll probably, 
try and stop at a few more stores and see where I can find a Colt 45 for you guys. That way we can do this Colt 45 in 45 seconds. Um, <coughs> so hopefully we find that and we're able to do that video. So I'm also looking for a few more uh, fireball things that I'm host supposed to be getting tomorrow. Well, all hopefully that goes through. And if not, uh, we will be continuously on the hunt for the items that I need for those drinks. Uh, being in a smaller town, it's kind of hard for me to get certain things unless I drive out really far. But I'm trying, guys. I promise. I promise. But, um, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. If you don't know yet by now, my name is Justin. Smash that subscribe button below. Hit the likes. Hit the comments. And let me know what you want me to try next. Last night's live was amazing, and I'm ready for tomorrow's live again as well because we go live Monday, Wednesday, Friday. We post videos Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday, guys. Cheers. <sighs> Warming. I like it. It's refreshing. Guys, thanks for watching. Remember, I'm biased. You guys don't have to. I tried to. You guys don't have to. Y'all have a blessed Tuesday. I'm going to go do some Mustang stuff over at my buddy's house, Ray's, after this settles in my stomach, because drinking and driving is a bad, guys. Don't do it. Don't do anything dumb. If you do do anything dumb, name it after me. Till later. Till next time, I'll see you then. Catch you later, guys.